Okay everybody assalamu alaikum so in this class i'll be discussing one more question relevant to macroeconomics and this is uh, for guest paper june 2024 exam series okay so question number 1 says assess the impact of globalization foreign direct investment multinational companies increase in local investment rise in gdp of the country of Uh, uh rise in gdp on standard of living of poor nations low income countries or developing countries so examiner will not use a lot of like words that i have used in this question for example examiner may pick any one of these like globalization foreign direct investment multinational companies increase in local investment or rise in gdp so examiner will pick any one of these statements so examiner sometimes also uses like foreign aid the impact of foreign aid on standard of living of poor nations poor nations are basically the low income countries or developing countries so this is exactly the same thing so what should be the answer to this question so uh, let me share with you some important assessment objectives and then you can figure out how to cover each uh, assessment object objective so assessment objectives include like assessment objective 1 and 2 and 3 assessment objective 1 is knowledge and assessment objective 2 is analysis and assessment objective 3 is evaluation okay so uh, in knowledge what you have to do you have to pick the main term terms that are given in the statement of question for example examiner uses globalization then you will have to explain globalization thoroughly and then you can describe what standard of living is and what are the low income countries features of low income countries right so then you have to move to the analysis part now you will say that how globalization can improve standard of living of low income countries so you will like create your uh, uh kind of analysis where you will try to determine that whenever globalization increases it increases standard of, standard of living of low income countries how it increases uh, you have to like uh, use the concept of ppc where ppc you can shift ppc curve to the right or you can use 45 degree line concept of 45 degree line and aggregate demand and aggregate supply curve as well so you will shift aggregate demand curve to the right or you will shift aggregate expenditure line upward showing increase in national income by multiple times uh, depending upon the value of multiplier and on the other hand you will have to write like write against this analysis as well and it is called evaluation and during evaluation you may you may say that globalization may harm the standard of living of low income countries and you can give judgment for that as well and your an evaluation must end with a final uh, like conclusion or judgment so let me show you the exact answer you can uh, just read this answer uh, so this is the exact answer to this question question number 1 you can read the statement of question as well and then you can take this screenshot if you wish otherwise you can stop the video read this part and then play the video again right so initially you have to explain the basic knowledge right then you have to move to the analysis part okay so this is the aggregate demand and aggregate supply phenomena that can be used Okay, whenever there is, uh, it is basically not only price, rather price level. And uh, you can further move to uh, whenever there is increase in foreign direct investment, then uh, or globalization or even local investment aggregate demand will shift to the right. And equilibrium will move from E naught to E one. Price level will increase from P to P one, and real GDP will increase from Y to Y one. So rise in GDP from Y to Y1 shows economic growth, and when whenever there is economic growth in a country, standard of living may improve. Okay, so you can uh, keep reading. 
Uh, I also suggest all of you to get try to get this book as well. This contains uh, important essays that are completely solved. So you can order them online as well. So I'll give you the like link in description so that you can reach this book and order online. So this is the concept of 45 degree line, right? Where increase in investment will shift aggregate expenditure line upward. National income will increase from Y to Y1. So this rise in national income will be multiple times more than the rise in investment. And you can also make the use of production possibility curve as well. And okay, so you can shift PPC to the right showing potential economic growth or you can show movement inside the curve towards the PPC for like actual economic growth of the developing country. Okay, so continue reading the answers. And uh, this answer is compiled for like 20 out of 20 marks. So if you read all of them and you can reproduce the similar type of answer, then for sure you can get like 20 out of 20 marks. And this is the end of this answer. So I believe you have taken the screenshots or you have read the answer thoroughly and this is it for this video and see you in the next video soon allah hafiz